60 years ago, this old Latino community here in East Stockton was known as Barrio Chivo, but a crosstown freeway divided this neighborhood. Now, Fairly New Center is bringing people together. In 1969, Vietnam War veteran Richard Soto picked up his first literature book that detailed the rich history of Mexico and Mexican Americans. You're always going to know my favorite books because they got a heck of writings. <laughs> Soto had just returned home from war. He was a surgical nurse attached to the United States Marine Corps. The Chicano movement was already underway when Soto noticed a big problem. Mexicanos, Chicanos were demanding uh, classes about us, and we got them, but there were no books. Soto knew these books existed and began a search. When he enrolled at California State University in Sacramento a short time later, he had already collected 25 books, which later turned into 125. It's my life. He now has more than 25,000 books in a new center he opened in East Stockton a little over a year ago. We spent uh, the first six months just pulling nails out, repairing things. From Pancho Villa to Cesar Chavez, there are also audiobooks and plenty of music in this special library. But Soto's favorite section is one that highlights his personal history. I got to say my favorite section is the war section. You know, the, there's a motto for uh, Vietnam veterans that... Uh, all gave some, but some gave all. Both of that applies to the Mexican community. Soto says his facility has also inspired young people to pursue higher education. Um, they helped me, help me to get into colleges. Even though it takes close to $2,000 to keep the center running every month, Soto says you can't compare that with the knowledge being passed along. What I want them to, to see and, and, and to leave with is a wealth of information that is available to them. And Soto hopes bringing new businesses into this area will attract more foot traffic and eventually more donors.